Hey everyone, welcome back here to the video. So, with Starfield finally coming out in just a couple of days, the discourse is getting worse and worse and worse. Because, my god, the level of cope from PlayStation fanboys is it's out of control. I've never seen this amount of toxicity from them on this level before. Never. For any Xbox game previously, not even freaking Halo, has triggered PlayStation fanboys this freaking much. I've never seen it before. Like, it's really cr It's insane. It's really nuts. So, who, who are we talking about today, folks? We are talking about King Thrash, or I like to call him King Trash, because that's what he is. He's trash. His content is trash. Like, it's, a bo it's bottom of the barrel. Okay. Well, what did he do that has got to, be to make this video? Well, he put out a really stupid, really freaking retarded tweet. So... So prepare to lose your brain cells, because, oh boy. Here's what he wrote. You cannot go to these plants because exploration was a lie. Jesus, it gets so much worse. He should, like, just, you're an idiot. You need to consider suicide. You see, you see the point? You see? My boy, Thrash. There's a freaking reason. Okay. I'll give you a second to think about it. No way, you don't even, you don't even deserve it, so... Let's see. Drum roll, please. You cannot walk on a gas giant. Get it? You cannot walk on gas, you freaking moron. You retard. You cannot walk on gas giants. Okay? Because that's a way for a more a realistic approach. More realism approach. Hence, they went to NASA to get data for, so for some of their shit. For some of their plans that they have in this game. Okay? It doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure out, did you even pass basic, you know, astrology? Did you even pass that? Did you even take that in school? Probably not. You probably failed the fifth grade, let's be real here. Because then how stupid you really are. You lack basic English and basic math skills. I mean, that's this guy really thought that 18 divided by 4 was 6. What does that tell you? Because 6 does not equal into, uh, it doesn't make any freaking sense. It doesn't. That's just just shows you how stupid this moron is. But, <laughs> but because of this tweet, oh boy, the amount of people roasting him, and he continues to double, triple, quadruple down because, like, again, he is a moron. He doesn't have basic. He doesn't have a brain. Like, just, pew, just reading this makes me lose brain cells. So, pew, I just shot myself. You know, theoretically. But anyway, let's go. So, you'll have to suffer too. Those are gas giants though. Nowhere, nowhere to walk on, LOL. Why not? It's a video game with alien creatures and chat packed spaceships shaped like robots. Why is the line drawn on gas giant exploration? I feel kind of funny. Like, haha, -ha, funny. Oh, I, oh, I don't know. Because Bethesda went for more real for a more realism approach when it comes to their sci-fi and what they were going for with Starfield. Like, hello? Did you even think of that? Again, again then again, you don't because you don't know the basic of, oh, I don't know, astrology? Because if he did, you would freaking realize, realize this. But again, you don't. So, because you're a fanboy. <laughs> and console fanboys lack brain cells. Anyway, let's keep going. Uh it's, it's a gas giant. You physically cannot walk on gas. Never see a quote-unquote adult, so trigger it over a video game before ready for another 100 balls bashing Starfield tomorrow. And King Trash responds back, You cannot phys you can't physically use chat packer make aliens to the pets using my control, but I mean, here we are. Oh, trap. Oh, 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 now, you see, he's moving the goalpost now? You, you see the mental gymnastics he's jumping to now? To try to bring that, bring that into it? Okay, let's see, mind control. Oh, I'm, not, I'm pretty sure that's a skill that's been in Elder Scrolls, I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong about that one. I'm not, because I played Skyrim for quite a bit, so, then again, it's been a while since I played Skyrim, to be fair, though, so, it's been a while, but, here's the thing, though, so, I, Kind of lost interest in Star in uh, Skyrim after a while, but I did enjoy what I played of it. So then I just lost track of time, to be quite honest with you, because like, because my brain can be scattered when it comes to uh, other games that catch my attention more. 
but I did enjoy Skyrim for what it was, and I did play a bit of Fallout 3 too, but that was even before I played Skyrim. So Fallout 3 was actually my first Bethesda RPG, and I, I liked, you know, Fallout 3 for what it was. So again, I kind of lost it. I kind of, my, sometimes my brain could kind of jump to other games that catch my interest more, but, but I have a feeling my brain will be attached to Starfield far more because I'm, I'm, a, I'm a huge guy on sci-fi. But that's not the point though. So I'm pretty sure you can, at least in Elder Scrolls, I think you can do uh, my control at least. So, so people who uh, played Fallout a hell of a lot more than me, maybe you could correct me maybe, but I think don't think you can, but then again, I could be wrong. So it's been a while since I played a Fallout game. But you kind of get my point though. So, so see, he's try you see what he's trying to do? He's trying to move the goalpost by moving it to something else to try to bring it into comparison because since it's a video game, you know, you should be able to do a gas giant. Like I said before, Bethesda aimed for realism, which is why they worked with NASA to get data so they can use it for some of these planets. Okay. Like, Jesus, man. But you see what he's doing here? You see what he's freaking doing? You kind of get, you, you see what he's doing? Anyway, moving on. Man, I just came to see if you kept us up after everybody told you how wrong you freaking are. And it's still here. Holy crap, this ain't if, um, laugh emoji. And Trash responded with, What am I wrong about, Edelwal? I can't help everyone replying is freaking wrong. You were just masturbating, weren't you? What the fuck? No, you're a crazy bitch. Uh, yes you are wrong, Trash. Yes you freaking are. Because basic science what tells you it's a fact that you cannot, there is no solid ground on gas giants. Like if you were actually to walk, you would you would get killed almost instantly since there's no solid ground. And ships can't land on gas giants either. So either way, you cannot walk on gas giants without some sort of special platform or whatever. Because in most cases, you cannot. Like, it's been scientifically proven, okay? It's been proven, but then again, you you probably feel basic math or science. <laughs> As it's been proven that you're a freaking moron, so... Anyway, with those responses out of, the, out of the freaking way, it's actually been pointed out that an entire article was actually made on him getting roasted for failing basic astrology. And as my boy Gas from Game On Daily pointed out, and this is kind of wild, that this sort of thing, you know, console wars have reached freaking articles now. It, it's it's really it's been really intense, especially when it comes to Starfield, bro. Like it's been, it's been wild. <laughs> so as I said, Gas pointed out, and Ga and King Trash noticed it and said this. Well, these idiots made a whole article about me saying we should be able to explore gas giants so you somehow think this is impossible in the video game that allows you to travel at light speed. I mean, clearly, you haven't played Mass Effect, but hey, I'll let me cook. My god, are you still talking? Oh, hell no, you didn't. You, you motherfucker, you mother, you did not freaking just bring up Mass Effect because if you play that freaking, you play that freaking franchise, you would know damn well that you cannot, you, you cannot and travel on gas giants on foot in those games either. You cannot. All you could do with gas giants in, the, in that franchise is collect resources. So if you knew, you, so if you play that, you know damn well that you cannot do. Oh, uh, that's it. I'm done. I'm done. I'm not coming back anymore. I'm done. I'm done. Ugh. <sighs> Oh my god, this freaking moron. Oh, I cannot believe you even tried to bring up Mass Effect into this because you cannot do that in Mass Effect like you can in Starfield. Oh my god. And not to mention they're two completely different franchises. One is a franchise that's been around the 360 since the 7th generation, by the way. And then the other one is a brand new IP that we don't even know will be good yet. And based on everything I read, it's going to be... I've apparently heard that it's going to be... It's really freaking good in a Game of the Year contender from what I'm hearing. Which is great because it's something that Microsoft and Bethesda desperately needed. But that's not the point though. 
Oh my god. Like, you see how stupid this moron is? You see how freaking dumb he freaking is? Like, Jesus. Jesus Christ, man. Jesus. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just killed every single brain cell in my brain from reading, from reading this stupid shit by Sarash. I'm sorry, trash. Excuse me. Huh, you see, why do I put myself through this? Why? I guess for your entertainment, I guess, but... Oh, my God. Uh, thank God. Oh, my God. It just keeps going, too, man, because... Because Mezcast guy, he put out a video saying uh, that Microsoft is blocking reviewers from reviewing Starfield. Uh, once you actually look into it with certain websites, you kind of understand why they did. I don't agree with it, but it is what it is at this point, but... Uh, I'll get to that eventually, too. I'll just lose even more brain cells from that. Uh, but Starfield's almost here, finally. Because if it's actually a good game, oh my freaking god. And if it gets and somehow wins game of the year, it's already looking intense already. And you add Starfield to it, oh man. The salt, if Starfield wins, my god, it's going to be on a whole nother freaking level. And, I'll, and, I'll, and we'll all be here for it. <laughs> because it's how. Hilarious to see these console fanboys lose their shit over a pla for a platform from a get from a, a game for a platform they don't even quote unquote don't care about yet that's all they freaking do that's all they talk about rather than playing games on their own platform they're worried about what Microsoft is doing it it was refereeing their head it's pr it's pretty hilarious I gotta say so uh, anyway I guess while we wait for stuff to release the next couple of days how about you hit the like comment subscribe. Whatever you saw, choose to, and I'll see you on the next one. Till then, have a good one.